When train accidents happen, most of them are caused by human error. But however, not all accidents were caused by human error. There were some other accidents that were caused by human error like the weather, the landscape, and fog. But in 2004, two CSX trains collided in Zebra Hill, Florida 16 years ago today. And this is the story of the 2004 Zephyr Hills, Florida train collision. On November 29, 2004, CSX Manifest train Q44128 was routed through Tampa, Florida. The train consisted of two engines with CSX SD70M4695 leading, CSX-840CW7803 trailing, and 137 freight cars, 99 loaded and 38 empty. The engineer was Gerald M. Whitehead II and conductor W. E. Taylor. Meanwhile, CSX Stone Train K91628 was routed for Wildwood, Florida. The train consisted of two engines with CSX SD40-281 leading, CSX SD70 Mac 4810 trailing and 60 cars loaded with stone. The engineer was E.E. E. Anderson and conductor C.J. Jones. The two trains are face to face on the same track, but however, there is a way for them to pass safely. According to the instructions for the two trains, the CSX Stone train had to stop in a siding to allow the Manifest train to go by and then the stone train could continue on its way once the manifest train clears. The CSX stone train was approaching a yellow approach signal, telling the train to slow down, but however the stone train never slowed down and continued speeding up. As the CSX stone train was approaching the end of the siding, the crew saw a red signal and upcoming was the manifest train coming in the opposite direction. The engineer of the stone train puts the train's brakes into emergency and then him and the good doctor bailed out of the engine. The crew of the manifest train also did the same thing, but however, it was too little and too late. 